last game of the week. The Broncos at the Bills. Look ahead was eight. Reopened uh, at seven and a half. Now it's eight, 105. Total of 47. And Steve, um, you know, you're the consummate pro. You never stop looking to make a bet, even when you're doing a show. And that's what happened here. You deciding to go with the side on this, on top of the fact that you have Buffalo to close a teaser leg. Yeah, so Buffalo is a Wong teaser where we tease, you know, a, a favorite of um, right around eight down. And I'm looking at my power ratings. I only make this game six and a half. And I'm like, do I really want to have a position on Buffalo? Well, sure, it's a Wong teaser. There's nothing wrong with that. But I'm like, but I like Denver. I mean, I make it six and a half. This line's going to come down to seven, perhaps. And I even mentioned wait on the Buffalo teaser because the line could come down to seven. Well, if I think it's going to come down to seven, my goodness, I should grab eight right now. And I'm doing that live. I'm doing an addition. And that is a bet for me. Chris, uh, what about you on this game? Do you got something that you're eyeing? Um, not really. Other than the parlays that I have with the uh, Buffalo money line, uh, these I Buffalo needs this to get straight, and uh, I think that they're going to do that. And I think Denver's a feisty enough to keep this close. I don't think Denver's a lay down team. Uh, I gosh, I hope my alternate wins six and a half. They're not a Hope for that bet that they're not a layoff team. But uh, I I have this at 7.75, so a straight bet isn't uh, merited. I, I, I think both of these teams are going to make good effort. It's prime time. I look at look for it to be a close game. Uh, so that's why I went the money line parlay route on it. I, and I don't like teasing in this situation and not getting uh, the uh, past the one. So... I find the value in, in the money line. All right. For myself, I think Buffalo should have some success running and throwing the ball on Denver. Although it must be said, their defense has played a lot better uh, more recently. This isn't the same team that got their doors blown off by Miami. Denver might have some success running the ball, but I question how their O-line will hold up against a Bills defense that is still seventh in pressure rate in the NFL. And Denver's given up the eighth most sacks. Russell Wilson is not very good at avoiding sacks. He he holds on to the ball a little too long. Uh, for that reason, and even though the Bills seem to be trending down, I think this is the get-right spot, and Buffalo in a tease to close my Arizona tease is my... Uh, official play on this and i think the bills leg of the teaser is the strongest you might get to monday want to tease them and look into next week's action because i i, I feel pretty strongly about the bills uh chris is on bills money line to close a parlay steve uh, is on bills to close a teaser but he's also on denver plus eight a lot of action a lot of games covered um